For about three years now, I've been fighting a bad hip and found out that the ball of my joint and the socket were both disintegrating. Being myself, thinking, I'm independent, I can take care of this, never even thought about asking for any help. I thought, I need a ride home and a ride back to the hospital, that's it. Well, all of a sudden, all these girls in my Bible study, uh, okay, Karen, we know you're going in for surgery, what can we do? And I'm like, oh, well, well, we're bringing you food. We're gonna stay the night, we're gonna do that. It was amazing. We're family. We can almost tell because we know each other so well when one of us needs something, even if we don't know that we need it. I've worked in the medical field for 43 years, and in the last couple years I've gone into the billing side where I have no patient contact, and I really, really miss that. So um, it was like, oh, I get to help somebody. I get to do something for somebody. So it was really, it was cool. I was so, so grateful. I don't know what I would have done without them. If I'd have been on my own, I would have been in big trouble. These are my sisters that God gave me. I have family, I have three brothers, three sisters, but these girls are my soul sisters. This is my family and I know that I can count on them and I've never had um, so much love given to me. Knowing that you're part of a group and you, you can call on that group and you can't even explain that feeling. It's just a great feeling. It's um, a constant in our lives. There is never a day where I do not have contact with one of the girls, if not all of them. I don't imagine, I cannot even imagine not being part of a small group um, without that support system. You know, it's just phenomenal. Mm -hmm.